Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Reach Wrestling Live here in Tavistock. I am joined by my commentary partner, Big Papa Brady. And we are here to witness Joey Seven and the return of Cole Parker. Cole Parker looks fantastic, hasn't he? He's been in Australia for around about two to three years, learning from some of the very best that Australia has to offer. Right now he's having to hand his uh, guns that, to the referee. That's a tragedy. He needs them. I mean, what if he needs to pull down halfway through? It's yes, it's glorious. It's just luxurious. He's got to use L'Oreal, sure. Yeah. And there is uh, Joey Seven. I, I just don't trust the guy. No, he's had a de very, very different attitude since, uh, well, turning to the dark side, shall we say. Well, the way that looks like that. Um, the face looks like that. There's, something, there's got to be something in that mind. Sinister. Yeah, 100%. I, oh, he's got the water bottles. What's going on? I don't know, are they having a duel? Joey Seven is unarmed right now. And we haven't, we haven't rung the bell yet either. What is going on? I actually do not know. I am waiting to ring the bell. And hope, there you go, look, he needed the strike. Luckily, the referee ducked then. I mean, I don't know how much commentary we can do on water bottle squirting, but we're going to... I don't know much of I don't know what the uh, rules are. I have no clue. Well, it looks like the fans want him to spray it. But well, they don't know what they want to do. Oh, there's the jewel, and he sprays him right in the face, but the bell hasn't won yet. So there is nothing we can do. Very, very smart play. How smart is it, though, for Cole Parker to anger Joey Seven this way around? I feel like we're doing something. Right, well, yet yeah, we do need to ring the bell. And we're just waiting for the referee signal. Good referee in that. Very good. Oh, we're going to push it our new referee, Dave. He didn't give me his last name, he just walked in and called himself Dave. I don't even know if that's his name, to be honest with you, but it sounds me that. Oh, into a look like a full house. He's got to go around. And oh, Parker's trying to float over. Joey Seven just catching him. Carl Parker getting the shoulder up just after the one count. I think what we've missed here is this is the number one contendership for Andy Watkins. This is the number one contendership for the championship. This is going to be the I've been in my stats, 100%. Right. Right. But then again, he did have to face Lucian Phillips. Oh, good. And that, that was a big test. It wasn't for the title. That was a very good point. It wasn't for the title. That has been his toughest test. But oh, yeah. Championship-wise, I completely agree. It's got to be one of these two. That is going to be the toughest test. Which one is it going to be tonight? I feel they've both got their uh, merit. Uh, and I wouldn't like to say something again. It's a moment. with the water gun. The bell has rung. Well, there was a little there was a little bit in there, but it's now not working. Oh! And he manages to spray himself in the face. I feel like that's happened to him before. It looks like it has. The look of shock on his face. I don't think he knew what was happening there. Oh! Oh, and done. Loads of reverse. Oh, oh, and hung up on that top rope to 14 from Joey Seven to Carl Parker. Now, Lytton, the sexy cowboy t shirt, offered the sexy cowboy. Why is he being back to such a consumer of the lovely ladies in the crowd that would love? And it looks like Joey Seven knows that. He's holding it up in the air. Oh, don't think they'll want it now no. as he blows his nose off. No, no. The is not attractive. No. Oh, and Carl Parker now. I hope that wasn't his only t shirt. That would be a travesty if it was, but he's going in with the right hands now. Trying to take Joey Seven into the turnbuckle, but both men reverse and each other went. Oh, and a big back suplex! This is a Hell Parker! This is a match of all the people. He was during the unit 10 days as well. They have faced up before, but both men are a lot further on in their careers. Like you say, Cole Parker has trained over in Australia. Well, Joe Seven has trained with some of the best in the country, including Joel Redmond and the English Lion, Eddie Wright. Destroy him! Oh! The official one is a little bit mean. Don't do that again. And yeah, he needs to have more authority. 
penalty here, to be honest with you. Oh, to be honest with you, I thought that should have been a disqualification. I don't know about you. I reckon it's a disqualification. Well, there's definitely a wire in his ear. On the other end, and that's going to be a hard Irish whip from Jones Bevan. Oh, it's the other end of that. And a hard Irish whip from Jones Bevan to the sexy cowboy. Carl Park Lark could have broken his back. That shifted the ring a good foot then. That was insane power out of Jones Bevan. With the hard scoop slam, Carl Parker going for the cover and Carl Parker. Oh, it's a good kick out. Very good kick out. Very good kick out with authority there. Not wanting to give up early on in this match. And now Joey Seven trying to slow things down with a nice sleeper hold there. Or it could be a rear chin lock. I can't really see from this angle, but it looks like it's wearing him down either way. The crowd who were against Carl Parker in the first round of fans. They can obviously see that he's on here. Yeah, when Carl Parker left, no one liked Carl Parker. Carl Parker didn't like the audience either. So it was only right that they treated him like that when he came back. But Carl has got a new outlook on life and a new outlook on his career since being over in Australia. It's done him the world of good. He did it for a while. It must have done. It must have done. Well, that's how it is. I mean, they are down under, aren't they? So they must walk around that side. We're going to have to pay them a visit and see what happens. Oh, no. well, anyway, we won't, we won't go on with where that's at least for us to. We're going to carry on looking at the sexy cowboy and Joey Seven. Nice snap there from Joey Seven as he goes into the corner. Oh, we're going to see here. oh wow! What a European that was! Diving straight into the face of Paul Parker. Paul manages to stay alive, but we can tell that locks him here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Big elbow to the back of the head as well. Which way both men are wearing each other down, you know. And as you oh. said that, Paul Parker jumping up and hitting the chop, but Joey Sutton very quick with the kicks to the top. Oh my god! Wow! I'm sure they heard that in Australia. They definitely would have heard that sound under, ladies and gentlemen, and that sounded like a shotgun going off. The security guy was holding his chest, he must have felt wow the reaction from everyone here. Says it all. Oh, and Paul Parker definitely goes in for a chop of his own, and it manages to send Joey up onto the spot. Oh, that is not a good that's spot. That's not where you want to be. That's not a good spot for Joey to be in. Paul, oh, don't do this. That is the guy's manhood. He don't need kids. And Carl Parker paying homage to the animal Batista there again. Oh, the fire up. Wow. <laughs> that is what they Oh, my. Oh. What? Wow. Inside out, upside down, doesn't matter. And now the cockiness of the king of the jocks displacing his foot on the chest. Cole Parker trying to go for that pin. Cole Parker, how he did it, but he managed to kick out after that. Huge lariat from Joey Seven. And he knocked the knees to study this match and prepare himself for what's to come. He's not facing the way like this. He's not at all. He's a hard hitting athlete. I think the only one, maybe two, that Andy not faced with the hard hit is yourself. Victor and Lucian Phillips. Yeah. He hasn't dealt with the technical side either, which both of them have the technical ability to match their power. Oh, that's close again. Close again. Huge kick out there. That's what I was going to say. Me and Lucian hit on. Both of these guys know the technical way around the ring as well as hitting it. So, we'll have to watch out there. Over 107 million there. And now the right hand's being thrown from the sexy cowboy here tonight. And now Joey Seven switching it up. Oh, he goes for that lariat again. Oh, Hulk Parker with the cross body. Are we going to see a three, ladies and gentlemen? No. Joey Seven with a kick out just before the three. Hulk Parker now trying to capitalise as quick as he can. Joey Seven, though, he's been doing this a while now, a very long time. So he's going to know Paul Parker's tactics and he, like I say, he's got four and these chops are absolutely devastating.
devastating. They are disgusting to take as well. You can see the welts on the chest starting to form. I don't know how much more punishment Carl can take here. Big bang, body drop, excellent. Come on, Carl. Come on.
sure what was in the arsenal of Cole Parker there. And he's going to go into a rip course. Oh, he's going for the elbow. And now Joey Seven now gets him up on the shoulders. He's been looking for it. Oh, TKO! That's it. This has got to be it. This is it. Oh, the fuck? The fuck's on the road! Well, I wasn't expecting that. I've got to be honest with you. I did not expect that. Uh, here tonight, an incredible second match. After the disappointment in the first match, I would say, even though I wasn't a fucking fan of how he won that, the, the match itself was very, very, very good. We are back on track with this show now, ladies and gentlemen. King Kong Showcase, I can't guarantee that. He just turns up like a bad smell. He just turns up. He just turns up. Yeah, I'm doing it. 24 song, 15 minutes, you got it.